Hey everyone, welcome to class. This class is going to be a no bouncy class. So no bouncing. What do I need to explain? You know what bouncing is. We're not doing it. Still going to be challenging. We're still using our dumbbells. We're still moving at a nice steady pace. Going to get our heart rates up. Going to do a bunch of extra abs, but no bouncing. Want the format? How about the format? So we have three blocks. We have a combo move that we're going to learn. And then we have another one. And then we're going to do them together. We'll do two sets and then we'll do an ab interval block. And that's all you guys, that's it. That's the class, it'll be three blocks. It'll be combos, abs, combos, abs, combos, abs, the end. How do we start? We start with a warm up. So take your feet wide and take a deep breath all the way up. And exhale, shake it out. Oh, should I add the music here? Yes. Okay, here we go. Give me some yeah. butt kicks right here, heels back. Here's a little production secret. I've had the music in my ear the whole time and I will add it later in post-production. Amazing, arms up. Here's eight, add a little bounce if you want. Let's do four, three, two. How about a tire run? Just in and out. The balls of your feet, shake your arms out a little bit. Just getting loose, getting warm and turn this into a cha-cha step. One, two, three, twisting in your waist. Let's do a punch down and up, a little squat punch. Now you could stay here or add a little bit of power if you want, but this is a no bounce class. So feel free to not bounce at all. Let's just switch arms down and up, just like this, like this. If you want, a little power, but not necessary. Here's four, three, two, good. Shuffle, shuffle, and a little squat. Shuffle, squat. Hips back. Give me four, three, here's two. And one that step forward, do some big arm circles, and lunge tap. Push away, push away. Can go a little off the beat here. One more, two more, I mean. This is your last one. Sit back right here, a little stretch, toe up, sit back. Same thing over here. And very good, come to a wide plie, little side to side move. Sit nice and low, lean back, relax your toes. Now punch with a twist. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Toes forward, hands behind you, fold. I'm looking at the grumpiest little dog face, but I love it so much. Bend your knees, drop your arms, you roll up, interlace your fingers, palms forward, push shoulders down. And inhale, reach up. Exhale, shake it out, perfect. Grab your dumbbells. Let's get going. Block number one. Okay, here we go, block one. Let's give this a try. One weight in each hand. Our first combo move. Your feet are wide. You're starting low. Your arms are in this position. All right, we're doing a press all the way up, all the way down, and then elbows come in for a pec deck. Your heels come up at the same time, like that. That's super easy. Are you ready? To the beat, if you want. Here's four, three, shoulders relaxed. Let's go. It's up, down, and then in, out. All the way up. Good, really push off the balls of your feet. Use those calves. Up and down, and close as your heels come up. Good. Relax your fingers, don't squeeze your dumbbells to death. It's up, down, and in, and out. Up, down. Very good, let's do four. Close. My shoulder's popping. I wonder if this fancy mic could pick that up. That's a nice sound. One more. And in, out. Very good. That's not so bad, right? So our next move, our second move, starts where we finished. Sitting low in your little plie. Arms up, like you're about to do a pec deck. You are going to start to your left and do three twists. Everything below your waist doesn't move. Everything above your waist is moving. So we'll go twist 
and twist and twist and then going back like you're gonna do a fourth but really you're going to balance in your right foot lift that back leg if you can if not keep it down we're going to do a back fly nice and steady and slow close it bend your arms coming up step back aha and you end up in the same place okay you guys are good you're smart you are strong i don't need to say more than that are you ready to give it a try in four three two twist for three twist twist on four reach and balance open open close close bend your elbows and one two three reach four open close bend repeat yeah good i was a little bit off on the beat with that first one i think i got a little confused but this is it now i'm sure of it and open close bend sit low twist 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 reach shift open close that back leg that's hard to balance this is your alternative if you don't want to balance just lean over open close bend it and right here let's do a few more twist 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 reach balance open close bend it'll get better twist 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 reach open close let's do one more it's a twist 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 reach open close bend and here you are <sighs> okay are you ready to put that together i am just going to start you guys can just start with me or watch once jump in when you're ready yeah don't worry we have a whole other set on this side to figure out if you're not quite there yet shoulders relaxed so up down so we do two of those and then one of the second one here we go up down elbows heels one more time straight up and down elbows heels now go to your left twist one two and reach balance open close bend your arms step back and repeat up down elbows again up down elbows twist it one two and reach balance if you can't open close right there repeat again up elbows one more and twist one two and three reach here's your no balancing today modification let's do two more up elbows again up and then twist one two reach open close bend and very good Whew. shaky shaky we are going straight into our second block going this way shake your little arms out if you need to a little faster on this side we know the moves scout check hey girl thanks for hanging out are you ready arms up shoulders down so this will just be a second set nothing different here up down up and elbows really bring your shoulders back over your hips so you don't want to be forward like that keep them right in the center up down and push through your heels let's do four and in out three here is two one more okay now we twist to the right first one two three reach how is balance over here do it again twist stay low and reach open close drop twist to the right and reach balance open and good keep it up one two three reach open let's do one more here's a twist and a reach open and bring it back <sighs> okay putting it all together one more time flying over here twisting to the right first do you remember that oh man where are you going okay bye are you ready let's just get into it toes wide sit low in your plie arms up shoulders down my shoulders are burning here's four three two up down elbows heels one more just like that up down and now twist to your right twist one two and now reach to the left balance or not 
Guess I wasn't balancing on that one. Press, elbows. One more. And good, we twist to the right, stay low. It's a twist, 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 reach, balance, open, close, step back. Again, press, elbows. One more. And good, we twist to the right. It's a twist, two, and then reach and balance. Open, close. I think balance is a little better for me over here. Today, to this side, up, down, twist, 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 and reach, and open, good, let's do two more, press, elbows, again, and then a triple twist, right first, one, two, and then reach, and balance, open, close, bend your arms, sit back, last one, up, elbows, one more, and then triple twist, Stay low, one, two, three, and reach. Open, close, bend, come back. Ah. Well, put your weights down. Shake them out, maybe do a little stretch. That was a lot happening in our shoulders, in our delts. Okay, so second part of this first block is on the floor with your mat. Grab your mat, meet me down there. We'll get into that first block of abs. Okay, so let's hit our first ab block. We're doing four moves and then putting them all together. Hopefully sticking to a beat, maybe, maybe not. You don't need any equipment, just you, just your mat, and that's it. Let's go, down on your back, feet flat. We are just starting with a double crunch and a double crunch extension. Alternating those two. Let me make sure my mic pack is not getting crunched because I've already broken enough of these this year. Elbows wide, chin up. So double crunch, shoulders and hips lift, and then extend on the second one. Here we go. It goes up, down, crunch, tap, and then crunch, extend. This is a little bit fast with this beat. If you feel like it's too fast, then go at your own pace always, of course. Good, keep it up. Lift, tap. Try to keep your chin away from your chest. Tap and extend. Let's do a couple more sets. Lift, tap, and extend. One more. And extend. Good. Next, we are doing fancy bicycles, which means they're not both going the same time. They're both straight. One comes in, and then the other one. Those are harder. We're doing them a little harder. Elbows wide, so right here. You have to bring your legs back before the other one can go. One has to return before the other has permission to leave. Right here, twist. Your modification would be bent knees and you don't extend them all the way or you can tap to the ground like this. So many options. In and out. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four, and three. Here is two, one more, and one. Okay, next, it's side crunch, side crunch. So we're going to crunch in, extend out, and then keep your legs low as you switch sides. And that is probably actually the hardest part. So right here, crunch in and out. It's in, out, shoulders up, legs low as you switch. In, out, and over, nice and steady and across. You can make it less hard by not keeping your legs so low to the ground. The lower they are, the harder it is. In, out, make sure your lower back doesn't lift when you bring your legs across. And switch, in, out. Let's do four more, in, out, steady, slow. In, out, two more. And one more. And very good. <laughs> you guys. Okay. One more. We're going to pulse. Keeping our legs up. Pulse, pulse. Nice and quick and steady. Four rounds of eight for us right here. 
All right, bend your knees to make it easier. Straight and low to make it harder. Ready? Right here. Shoulder blades off the ground, arms out. Extend your legs out. Ready? Let's pulse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's one. And two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One more. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Okay, ready to put it together? All right, starting with our crunch. Double crunch and then double crunch extension. Keep your legs out. We're gonna do one slow bicycle, one side. The other side, take it over to the side. One side crunch, over to the other side. One side crunch. Back to what we just did, eight of those. It'll be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. On eight, I want you to bring your hands behind your head if you're a music counter. If not, just follow me or do your own thing. Are you ready to give it a try? Yes. Elbows wide, chin up. Let's go in four, three, two, double crunch. It's in, tap, now extend, keep your legs out. Slow bicycle, one more. Get ready, arm out, crunch in out across one more time in and now stop halfway right here pulse one two three four five six and bring it back so we stopped on six not seven knee and knee take it to the side in out take it across in out and hold it here do six so it's one two three four five six repeat crunch Gives us a little time to start over. One side, the other side. And side crunch in and over again. And six little pulses. One, two, three, four, five, six. One more double crunch extension. And slow bike. One more. Arm out, crunch in. Take it across again. And right here, this is the end. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Hug it in. <sighs> How'd you do? How does that feel? Roll yourself up. Let's do a quick stretch. Interlace your fingers and reach all the way up and back. And shake it up. We are just getting started. That's one block down. Put your mat away, grab your dumbbells. Let's go into block number two. Okay, let's go for block number two. One weight in each of your hands. Your left hand is going to row twice. You're bringing your left foot back here. This will make more sense as I show you the rest of this combo. So we're going to pull. It's kind of like starting an old timey lawnmower. <laughs> like that. I mean, I haven't mowed a lawn for a very long time, but I'm guessing it's more like that now. You guys can let me know. Okay, so right here, you're going to pull once and then twice. Keep your heel up when your arms are in front and then it's going to drop when you pull. So it'll be pull one more and then you're going to step out with that pulling hand to the side and bring your arm up to a high V. This one is a low V, feet are wide. You're going to switch when you squat Switch again, stand up, and then bring your left foot back to where you started. So it'll be pull and pull. It'll be out, switch, switch, and down. Those are hard when your arms are straight. Slow down if you have to. Are you ready? Let's give it a try. Let's go. It goes pull, one more. Now step to the side, big step. Drop, repeat, right here. Pull, a little bent in your knees, bend in your knees. Right here, bend, and then they straighten a little. Straighten a little, and step, drop. Try it again, pull, pull. Step out, up, switch. Let's do two more. Pull, pull, step out wide, squat, switch. One more, pull, and pull, take it out squat switch and there you go okay great job number two you're going to bring your feet about meh, hip width or so apart arms in nice and tight so this is a little bit fast if you stick with the beat 
but either way you want to stay nice and tight and controlled we are doing a squat nice low chair squat and then circle your head keep your weights kind of close together it's easier to control them than if they're kind of far away from each other so it's a squat and one halo squat again the other direction now squat again you're going to shift your weight into your right leg bring your left knee up balance arms up extension kick and tricep and switch and then step to the side and repeat yes i'm going to start jump in do it with me so it's a squat a controlled halo squat again shoot it up knee kick just step to the side halo all the way around you really want to try to avoid punching yourself in the head or the face with those dumbbells while they're circling your head I've done it. I do not recommend it. Lift, kick, great job. Let's do about four more. Lift, kick, three more. Dip, and a circle. Circle, and a kick, extend. Two more, drop. Take it all the way up, kick. One more time. And then finish it out and right there. Now, the only thing that you have to know when we put these together is how to get back to that first combo. This is how you do it. You're going to lift, kick. After that kick, right away, you just step back and bring your weights out in front of you. So we have two long lower pulls. Step out, you're coming all the way back, finishing that move, and then stepping out before you do your first halo. Hope that helps. Are you ready? Reach in front, little bend in your knees, getting ready to pull. In four, three, two, right here, let's go. Pull, one more. Step out, arm up, switch, switch. And finish it, then step out, halo. One more. And then punch up balance. So right here, right away. How did that go? To the side. Switch. Finish it, squat halo, again, power it up, balance, kick, step back, bring it in front, to the side, switch, switch, and squat halo, again, shoot it up, tricep, and around, two more times, to the side, big step, and squat halo circle shoot it up balance knee and one more pull big step switch switch and squat halo one more and kick it up and very good all right shake your arms out quick drink if you want little break and let's do all that one more time. The other side. So it'll be your right arm pulling this time. Are you ready? In four, three. We have to stay to the beat. Two, and one. Let's go. Pull twice. Little bend in your knees. Step to the side. Switch, switch. I don't think I've ever done it on this side, actually. I've been practicing only on the other side. Feels a little weird. Up. Elbow high, big step, switch, switch. Let's do four more. Big step, squat, and three. Good, just two more. Pull, take it up, switch, squat, one more. And to the side, switch, switch, finish it there. From here, just step out, halo, everything the other way. Are you ready? In three, two, let's squat, halo again. And now shoot over to the other side and try it again, squat, halo. And lift and kick, good. Doesn't matter which direction you're haloing first. We are doing both. And that's 
what matters is that you alternate the direction after doing one. Woo. Balance on that one. Nope, no thanks. Dip, lift. Good, let's do two more. Circle. And all the way up. One more. Halo. Shoot it. And good job. So if you remember, when that leg is out, you're going to bring it right back to start from the top. Are you ready? Okay, well, let's go pull twice. One more. Now step to the side, arm up. Switch, switch. Good, now squat halo twice. Circle again. Shoot it up, right knee up, kick. Right away, step back, pull. Good, to the side, straight arm up. Switch, switch. Step out, squat halo. And shoot it up. Shoot it up, probably not the best term to use, pull. Again, to the side, switch. Very good, step out, halo. How is the side? Any better? Balance. It's questionable sometimes, you guys. Step to the side, switch, switch, and step out, halo. And over to the left, right knee up. Last one, let's make it good, pull. To the side, switch squat, and squat halo, and circle, and circle, shoot up, and extend, and amazing job. Okay, dumbbells down, bring that mat back out. Let's go for ab block number two. Abs block number two, we start in a plank, elbow plank. Forearms on the floor, belly lifted, butt down. Let's just get into this first one. All it is is a rock. We've done this plenty of times, rock forward and back. Let's just get into it right here. You could do fists, you could do palms down. Either way, bring your legs out, keep your hips low, just forward and back, nice and steady, forward and back. Try to use a full range of motion, really push off of your toes back to your heels. So let your butt go up and down. It's just going forward and back, forward, back. Good. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four, and three. Last two, one more, and one. Good job. Drop your knees down. We're moving on to our hands, shoulders right over your wrists. We're just bringing your knee to your shoulder, same side shoulder, and then the other knee, and then twist under, twist under. Yeah, nice and slow, nice and steady. Let's go, right here. So it's shoulder, shoulder, and then twist dip, and again. Again, so one side, the other side, dip twist, twist. Keep your hands wide, your fingers spread wide. And one side, the other side, hips stay low, twist. Two more sets. Twist it. And one more time, shoulder, shoulder. And twist. One more, and very good. Take it to your knees. Okay, shake it out a little bit. Number three is actually starting where we just finished on your hands and your plank. We're gonna do two little hops to the side, two little hops back, or you could do step, 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 side to side. So right here, belly tight, two little hops. It goes hop, hop, bring it back and back. Go ahead, jump in if you haven't. Here's your modification, step, 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 and back and back. That's all it is, is little baby steps. So hop, keep your belly nice and tight, especially if you're jumping. Good, let's do four. And three. Hips slow, two. One more. Bring it back, and one. Okay, our last of our four is onto your elbows again. All it is is a plank to a dolphin. So right here, start from your plank. A dolphin is like a downward facing dog, but your elbows are on the floor instead of lifted. 
just up and back. That's all it is. Nice and slow and steady. Right here, push back and forward. Lift up, return like there's a string on your belly, lifting you from behind. Lift up and then all the way back down. Let's do four. Here's three. Here is two. One more. Up, up, and down, down. Okay, putting that all together. It's pretty slow, not slow, it's steady, but I'm not going to show you. I'm just gonna start. I'll tell you what's coming, what we're doing. Either start with me or jump in when you're ready. Okay, so we start on our elbows, doing our rocks forward and back. Elbows down, we're doing three of these. Lift your belly, drop your hips, Ready to try it, forward and back. One, two, one more. And now move up to your hands, knee to your shoulder. One side, the other side, twist dip. Again, two little hops to one side and back the other side. And drop to your elbows, slow. Take it to your dolphin, up, up, back, back. Hold it and repeat, forward, back. One, two, three, to your hands, knee to your shoulder, the other side, twist, twist. Again, hop, hop, one side, and again, the other side. Take it to your elbows, nice, slow, steady, push back, come back down, hold, squeeze, and rock it forward, up. One more. And to your hands. One side, the other side. And twist. And then little hops to the side. Hop, hop. Or step, step. Keep your hips low. Everything is tight. Now elbows. And push back slow, up. Squeeze back and hold again, forward and back. One, two, one more. And then hand, hand. Good, and knee. The other side. Twist and dip. And little hops, side, side. Shoulders right over your wrists. Don't let them fall back. And then down to your elbows. And push back. Dolphin, bring it back. Hold, one more time. Block it, let's go up. One more, hands, hands. Good, now knees again, other side. And dip, dip, twist. And little hops to the side or step, step, step. And then last one, dolphin slow. Push back and lift back to the center. Hold, hold for four, three, two, and one. Knees down, ah, sit back. Bring your arms back, shake about. Probably feel it in those shoulders a little bit. Again, okay, that's block number two. Done, grab your weights. One more time with your mat. We're going to start with our final block, number three. Okay, are you ready to get this one done? Block number three, our first of our last comma moves is a pull, pour, pull, pour, curtsy. So pull, pour, palms up. You're pulling behind you as much as you can with your elbows. Pull when you come up from this little squat. Thumbs down, pour. You have two drinks right in front of you, pour. And then you're going to pull again. And then this time when you pour, you're going to bring them out in front of you more and step your foot back for a curtsy. Don't step on your mat. That's not helpful at all. So that's it, easy. First one, pull, pour. Pull curtsy, always going to the right for this round. In four, three, Two, here we go. Pull, pour, pull, and curtsy. Dip, and dip right in front. Not going too deep into that squat or that curtsy back. Good. Let's do four more. Right here, four, pour. Three, Here's two, 
one more and finish it right there good job oh, you guys shoulders what was i thinking your left leg is behind you when you finish you're stepping that left leg forward for a front lunge your arms are out here turn your wrists towards each other they're just going to swing by your sides push away up and they kind of have a second or two in the middle there working what oh just working your shoulders a little bit so you're gonna do two front lunges with that little swing front lunge push away the other side push away then bend your elbows in for one nice perfect deadlift and then they finish out in front of you and you'll repeat okay that's number two ready starting with your left leg forward let's go so down push away and deadlift and back in front big step push back bring it in deadlift bring it back to the front step bring it in and out big lunge step forward push off the back part of your heel to use your glute right here push down down up and forward step push away let's see two more step and step and down and last one step push bring it in deadlift and forward okay that's it those are our final two we are putting those together pull pour pull forward curtsy the transition i kind of showed you already you're just going to step forward that's so easy that's hardly a transition so after that down down up up instead of punching again forward you're going to go down down up up step to the side for your pull four just follow me you'll get it you guys will get it are you ready deep breath one side then the other side shoulders down and back get ready to pull pour in four three two let's try it pull pour curtsy now step forward step push away deadlift actually i think we might have time to punch first right here yeah we're all right so go ahead and step forward so you can finish your punch after this deadlift right here punch and then step to the side well that's a pleasant surprise step forward lunge and lunge bring it in deadlift punch forward step out pull pour pull curtsy step forward lunge and lunge bring it in deadlift and punch it out pull pour curtsy pour step step push away bring it in let's do a couple more pull pour curtsy pour step forward big step lunge push back deadlift and final one pull pour curtsy pour step forward and again deadlift down down finish with a punch in front okay all of that one more time and that'll be it for our combos so starting pull pour the only difference is you're bringing your right leg back for your curtsy all right so palms up feet wide are you ready in four three two pull pour and then curtsy right leg back pour good job thumbs down how are your shoulders huh. If you have to make it a little easier don't straighten your arms very much harder straighten them all the way let's do four pour three here's two one more last one oh it's getting a little questionable over here a little questionable my form on that it's getting a little tired so step forward lunge twice it's just going to be your right leg going first that's the only difference ready 
Let's go. So step, other leg, pull it in for your deadlift, punch it, repeat, swing. You're swinging, but still controlling your arms for this lunge. Control, step, bring it in. Really use your glute by dropping low, pushing back. Pull it in. Great job. Push. We've got four more. Give us four. In, down. Flat back, of course. And then the last two. All right, last one. Lunge and lunge. Deadlift, finish with your punch in front. Right there. All right, we're all ready to our combo. This is it, feet wide, shoulders down, pull, pour. In four, three, two, let's go. And then curtsy. Step forward, right leg lunge, push away. And then deadlift. Step out to the right, repeat. Curtsy. Step forward, lunge, push. Deadlift. Repeat, pull, pour. Thumbs down, curtsy. Forward. Deadlift. Repeat, pull, pour, and forward. Deadlift. Let's do two more sets. To the side, pull, curtsy. Forward step, push. Deadlift. Down, down, up, up. Last one, pull, pour, pull. Step forward, lunge, push away. Bring it in, deadlift. Finish with your punch. <sighs> Excellent. Put your dumbbells down. We have abs. One more ab lock. One last time. And then that's it. Really good job. Okay, here we go. Let's get into our final ab round. On your back, elbows wide, circle sit-ups. Big circle. And then reverse, go the other way. Feet flat, knees up. Let's go. This is number one of four. And then we'll put them all together. Elbows wide, chin up. Are you ready? Here we go. In four, three, two, big circles. It's up and around, up and around. Like there's a marker on your head, tracing a circle and then retracing it. Nice and control, circle. Let's do eight, seven, six, five. This is four, three, and two, one more, and one. Perfect. One crunch, one full sit up. That's it. One crunch, one full sit up. Right here. Let's go. Here's your crunch. And all the way up. So we're not going to be on the beat for this one. At least I'm not. Now when we put them together, it's not going to affect that. So don't worry. If you are so excited to go to the beat for these sit-ups, it's still gonna happen. Now, for now, for this set, one crunch and come up all the way. If you're feeling really strong, if you can keep your hands behind your head, my abs, they are done right now. So that's not gonna happen for me. But it, if it happens for you, I'm very, very happy, very proud. <laughs> Let's do two more. Crunch, all the way up. One more time, and we are going to stay sitting up after this one right here. Oh, you guys, I tried to keep my hands back. I couldn't even do it, that's embarrassing. So next, legs up or legs down. We're just going to do a boat with a punch. Yeah, so nice and slow. Just a punch and a punch. Chest is lifted, just like this. Your modification, heels would be down, chest is still lifted, and try to lean back. Punch and punch, a big twist. Let's do eight, seven, six, five. Let's do a slow four. And a three, and two, one more. 
and one. Good, I feel better about myself after those. Last one is an X and an O. So we're already in our O right here. Then you are going to kick your arms and legs out for your X and then come back up. Yes, out in, in, nice and steady. I don't know how the beat's gonna work with this one, but I guess we'll find out together. Nice and slow, I think we'll be fine. So right here, we'll go out, out, and in, in. Yeah, we're good. Out, out, in, in. Now if you want to, you can come flat. That'll give you a little break down here, but still you have to go down nice and controlled or hover, which is harder. Out, out, and in, in. Let's do four. And three. I am showing the modification two. <laughs> and one more. Out, out, in, in. <sighs> I am very happy this is the last block. My abs are done. So let's put all that together. Start flat on your back. Nice and steady. We'll start with a circle sit up twice. One crunch, one full sit up. Yeah, stay up there. Four punches, one, two, three, just four. We're gonna go all the way down, all the way up, and then all the way back down and just starting over. Stay with me, we got this, we are almost done. Here we go, circle sit up, circle it up, and the other way, crunch, and then all the way up, stay up, punch for four, one, two, three from here, go to your X, 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 O, O, and X, X, and then drop, repeat, circle. The other way, crunch, all the way up, legs up, punch for four, three, two, X, and O, slow, X, and O, slow, X again, but stay there, bend, and repeat, circle, up, and up, crunch, all the way up, and boat. Four, three, two, and take it out, and up, <laughs> out, and stay there. One more, circle, and circle, crunch, all the way up, and boat. Four, three, two, this is it. Take it to your X, to your O, one more time, and stay there. <sighs> that was really great. Good job. My abs, my shoulders, who needs them? Not gonna be able to use them tomorrow. Not me. Bring your feet closer together. Interlace your fingers and just take a big stretch breath and a stretch all the way overhead. Push through your heels, open up through your rib cage. Bring your shoulders away from your ears. Good. I'm going to remove this music from my ear. Bend your knee and roll over to one side and grab your foot behind you, knees towards each other, heel to your hip, push your pelvis forward. Great job. Roll over and cross that leg that you had in your hand, that foot, onto your thigh for your figure four. I mean, you'd think that by now I'd know how to plan a workout and what to expect, but nope. Not, not yet, maybe eventually, maybe one day. Pull that leg in, lift yourself off the floor, shoulders down and do some foot circles. Listen to my ankles crack. Good, give yourself a little hug and let's go the other way. So one arm overhead, grab your foot, knees together, heel to your hip, pelvis a little bit forward, quad stretch. And then bring that foot over your thigh and push that leg away, lift your other leg up. And then this top leg goes up, the other one goes out, pull, push back into your hands, shoulders off the floor, chin down, and some more circles if you want. Good job. Let's roll up and let's do a nice shoulder stretch. Bring your arm right across, relax your shoulder down, and then pull it in. Try not to choke yourself with your arm, drop it down. So you should hopefully feel that right across your delt right there. And switch to the other side. Relax it and then pull. Good, so this leg grabs your opposite knee, pulls so you're twisting, use this hand, 
to push behind you and look over your shoulder. And the other way. And let's go to one side. Keep your opposite hip on the floor and you can bend this elbow to get a deeper stretch and take it to the other side. And back up. We are going to end with a little camel pose, stretching out that belly that we worked a lot. Hands at your lower back, push down through your pelvis, shoulders down and back, open up through your chest, send your hips forward and look up. Take a deep breath and fill your belly with as much air as you can. And exhale. One more breath. And come back forward, sit onto your heels, interlace your fingers and push forward one more time, drop your shoulders and take a breath all the way up. And exhale and shake it out. The arms, have, have I mentioned the arms yet? I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know how you did, what you think, how you're feeling, how are your kids, how are your pets? Where's my pet? Snooty, come here. Come here, come say hi. People wanna see your face because they're so cute, come here. Come here, come to me, come to me. I did it, I got it. Um, Scout and I love you the most and we hope that you have a great day and really good job. We love you, bye. <laughs> bye you guys, bye.